Oslo, yeah, Oslo. Not exactly top of mind when you think must-see destinations. But this place, nestled between fjords and forests, it grows on you. Did you know Oslo was once a Viking hub? And it's got more Michelin-starred restaurants per capita than any Scandinavian city. We're gonna dig into this town, the beaches, the food, the people. No BS, no tourist traps. Just raw, unfiltered Oslo. Acre Brig. It's where Oslo lets its hair down. This revitalized waterfront, once a shipyard, is now a playground for the senses. You got your sleek yachts bobbing in the harbor, sunlight glinting off the water. The air is alive with the sizzle of seafood, the clinking of glasses, the laughter of locals and tourists alike. I'm talking fresh catches of the day, grilled to perfection, washed down with ice-cold local brews. This is the pulse of Oslo, a city that knows how to work hard and play harder. Gustav Vigeland, the man was obsessed. Obsessed with the human form, with capturing every nuance of emotion in granite. Over 200 sculptures, all stark naked, frozen in moments of joy, despair, love, anger. You walk through this park and it's like stepping into the mind of a madman, a genius madman. Kids playing, lovers embracing, a dude screaming at the sky, it's all here, laid bare. Makes you think about your own place in the world, your own struggles, your own naked truths. Forget your fancy restaurants, your white tablecloths and fussy waiters. This is where the real food is, the heart and soul of Norwegian cuisine. The air is thick with the smell of salt and brine, the clatter of fishmongers hawking their wares. Mountains of shrimp, glistening salmon, giant crabs with claws bigger than my hand. This is fresh, this is real, this is food that connects you to the sea, to the earth, to the very essence of Norway. Who needs the Mediterranean when you got Huck Beach? White sand, crystal clear water, pine trees swaying in the breeze, this ain't no tropical paradise, but it's got a raw beauty, a sense of tranquility that gets under your skin. Families picnicking, kids building sandcastles, couples strolling hand in hand, and the light, the way it dances on the water, it's magic. You can almost feel the stress melt away, replaced by a sense of peace, of connection with nature. This ain't your grandma's opera house. This is a building that defies gravity, a shimmering white iceberg rising out of the fjord. You can walk right up on the roof, feel the wind in your hair, gaze out at the city spread before you. It's like the whole of Oslo is at your feet. Inside it's all sleek lines, modern art, the sound of music echoing through the halls. This is a place where tradition meets innovation, where the past and the future collide. When the sun goes down, Grunerloka comes alive. This is Oslo's hipster haven, a bohemian playground of vintage shops, trendy bars and underground clubs. The air crackles with energy, with the sound of music spilling out onto the streets. You got your craft beer connoisseurs, your vinyl record enthusiasts, your artists and musicians, all drawn to the creative energy of this place. This is where Oslo lets its freak flag fly, where the night is young and anything is possible. This ain't your stuffy history museum. This is a living, breathing testament to Norwegian culture, a journey through time that will transport you to another world. You got your 150 historic buildings, each one a time capsule of a bygone era. You can walk through a Viking longhouse, step inside a medieval stave church, marvel at the craftsmanship of a traditional Sami tank. This is a place where history comes alive, where you can almost hear the echoes of the past whispering in the wind. Want to see Oslo from a whole new perspective? Head up to Holmenkollen, home of the iconic ski jump. The view from the top is breathtaking, a panoramic vista of the city, the fjord, the surrounding forests. You can almost feel the adrenaline rush of the skiers hurtling down the slope, the wind whipping through their hair. This is a place where you can breathe in the fresh air, clear your head, and appreciate the sheer beauty of the Norwegian landscape. Need a break from the urban jungle? Escape to the Toyen Botanical Gardens, a tranquil oasis in the heart of the city. It's like stepping into another world, a wonderland of exotic plants, vibrant flowers and towering trees. You can wander through the rose garden, lose yourself in the bamboo forest, marvel at the diversity of plant life from around the globe. This is a place where you can reconnect with nature, find a moment of peace, and appreciate the simple beauty of the natural world. As the sun dips below the horizon, casting long shadows across the water, the Oslo Fjord takes on a magical quality. The air is still, the water calm, the sky ablaze with color. This is a time for reflection, for savoring the moment, for appreciating the simple beauty of life. Whether you're sipping a beer on a waterfront patio, kayaking through the still waters, or simply sitting on the shore watching the sunset, this is a moment you won't soon forget. So Oslo, yeah, it's not all Viking helmets and loot fisk, though you can find those too if you look hard enough. This is a city that sneaks up on you, a place with a quiet confidence, a raw beauty that gets under your skin. It's got a pulse, a rhythm, a soul all its own. If you're looking for an adventure, for something real, for a place that will challenge your preconceptions and leave you wanting more, Oslo might just be the place for you. Just don't tell everyone.